Oh my god, Blogs Fest is less than a week away. Hey guys, it's Tom with the SS Motion here, and today I'm giving you your final look at Road to Blocks Fest. Now, some of you might be sad to hear that it's the final Road to Blocks Fest vlog, but to be honest, it's the final vlog because Blocks Fest is virtually upon us. Just after this time next week, we will be recovering from the event, as the event was one week yesterday. So, I have a lot of exciting things to talk about today. Primarily, we're looking at the three main stalls which will be at the event, other than Mega themselves, and obviously us and the things that we're selling. Okay, so I have three stalls that I'm allowed to give you an exclusive peek at. The first stall we're going to have is Goth in a Box, and Goth in a Box will be selling custom Halo Hammer Bead creations. So they'll be quite nice, and I imagine you're going to get some nice, maybe, characters made with the beads, possibly some other vehicles, scenes, so uh, a lot of possibilities for that and I'm quite excited to see what they're going to be doing. <coughs> Excuse me guys, I've been a bit ill recently, um, so I'm trying to get this vlog out even though I'm not in perfect condition, so I apologise if there's coughing or anything like that, I'm just not in a very good state at the moment. Um, in addition to that, we're going to have Alison Loves to Bake at the event and they will be selling Halo themed cupcakes. So that's going to be epic, you can take a bite out of the Halo lore, literally. So that's going to be really, really cool. And lastly, we have Neverworld. And Neverworld are going to be quite a big store who are going to be selling all your Halo needs apart from Mega Bloks. So Neverworld will be selling figures like the McFarlane figure you can see here. They'll be selling Action Clicks, which are the smaller McFarlane style things that you use in... A trading card game-esque sort of like scenario. They're also going to be selling Micro Ops, which are McFarlane's smaller scaled sets. They're going to be selling weapon scale replicas, so those are smaller sized replicas of weapons which look very nice on a desk. They're going to be selling pop art Halo figures, they're again very very nice. They're going to be selling Square Enix, which are the 9 to 10 inch figures, they're really really cool, there's like, I think there's Halo 4 Master Chief, Spartan Warrior, Spartan Soldier and Sarah Palmer, and they look really nice. And then they're going to be sending a couple of other bits and bobs as well, so it's going to be really cool to have them at the event. Then in addition to that, I do have a big announcement, and that is that a shipment from Mega Bloks has arrived. I can't go into too much what this shipment includes, but it does include posters, the rewards for contests, a lot of other awesome bits and pieces which you might be able to get your hands on at the event. Okay, and the other thing I'd like to mention briefly is that we recently purchased 40 plus sets which will be on retail at the event. If you follow our Facebook page you'll have seen a post uh, with the guys Simon and Craig holding shopping trolleys filled with sets. All of them are going to be directly on sale at the event for you guys. There's one more thing I want to mention briefly, and that is that the guys were recently invited to hold a live interview on Radio Warrington. That was a really, really fun interview. I'm sure a few of you listened in. But for those of you who didn't, I believe that the, vi the interview was recorded, and it should be available uh, shortly. So that's all I've really got to say in today's Road to Blocks test, guys. A lot of nice updates. I've tried to make this a bumper issue for you guys with several updates. <coughs> And overall, I want to say that I'm really excited for the event. Uh, it's my first year with the SS Motion. It's my first Bloxfest event. Um, so it's going to be an interesting experience, to say the least. But so far, I've had a heck of a time. It's been really, really fun. I've met some awesome people. And I'm really, really excited to meet you guys, the community, at the event on Saturday. Um, so yeah, that's all I've got to say, guys. See you on Saturday. Remember, it's six days to go. Six awesome days, which I'm sure we have plenty of content lined up for you guys to cover. And if you're excited, don't forget, follow our Facebook page, um, follow our YouTube channel, and then also look at the website we've now got set up. So that's all from me, guys. It's been Tom here once again with an exclusive look into the behind-the-scenes of Bloxfest with the Road for Bloxfest series. This is part three of three. However, don't expect this to be the last blog vlog from me. I'm sure there will be more in the future. And until Saturday, I hope you guys have a great week and I look forward to meeting you all. This has been Tom, I'm signing off for now.